Today's question comes from Frederico Stercelli, who asks, Dear Dr. Caliban, what about traps? Are they good? Is deadlier better? How complicated is too complicated? Well, this is a very good question, Frederico. Of course you're going to want some form of traps. You don't want to leave your evil lab vulnerable to the forces of justice and any other interlopers. With that said, you do have to assess a few things. What is your goal? Obviously, you want to keep interlopers out. Are you trying to destroy them or capture them? And what happens if a minion finds themselves accidentally caught in the trap? Now, I will always be an advocate for keeping things as uncomplicated as possible. That way, there's less to go wrong. However, we are evil geniuses, and we do tend to be a competitive lot. So we do want to get creative with our traps. This is why, for example, I like my bear traps. Again, those are traps with a cybernetic bear in it. Oh, it can be great. The interlopers are facing a mechanized machine of destruction and terror, and you can train the bear slash program it to not attack the minions. And oh, the video of anything that happens with that bear and an intruder. You can send those to your fellow evil geniuses with a little note saying, top that.